You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Super excited to check out a candy kit for you. Now this arrived to me in a subscription box from Japan Crate. A lot of times I get their subscription boxes and they have these little candy kits and I thought, hmm, this of course deserves its own video and it's from Kabaya. A couple things I noticed. One, these look like little malted balls because it's like a coating over a little crunchy center. Two, they have these colors listed here, pink, orange, white, green, and yellow. So I'm guessing they might each have a flavor. I'm not sure yet. And then there's all kinds of shapes. You have these cone shapes that look like ice cream cones. And then you have something like this, which looks like a little bus or a trolley or train, a rocket ship. So depending on the shape determines how they're putting them on the little half balls. These are not full shapes. Now I'm not sure if that's intended to look like that half. You just put the half in there and then it locks in. I don't know. Let me just look at the rest of the box. Okay, so there is a picture of it being unfolded to this. So I must follow those instructions. I see a couple things, a punch out here, but it says open here. So that's what I want to do. And now that we've looked at the box, I think I'm going to do that. So let me change my camera angle up and down just a little so I get a little more area here. Bring the camera out, there we go. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's see, carefully now, I need to preserve this. Okay, that opened real easy. All right, this looks like there was a stand inside, so you set them up on here to hold them in place. Here, I tell you what, I have a little glass holder from another video. Look like that, so then I can take these out. I mean, they're all just in a bag, so I don't see if there's any things hitting each other. Oh, they're already put together. I was thinking because they showed them separate like this that that's how they would be, but you just don't get them that way. Okay, so they're all different little shapes. Here, let's just get them in here. So do they show, they show some up and some down, but I think for showing you the designs, I'll put those that way and those that way, just like they have. So it's almost looks like a little cookie shape on the outside. And then this looks like the rocket ship. Is this my surprise one? It looks like a little house. Pretty neat. And what is that? It looks like a flower pot or an ice cream cone. Yeah, that's an ice cream cone. And then, okay, so this is a repeat. Let me move these out of here so I can at least show you the ones that I have. This looks like a little character, a little bear. And then this is another little basket-like shape. This kind of looks like a, like the vehicle on the front. That looks like a repeat of the house. That looks like a repeat of the vehicle. I think I've shown them all now. Ooh, that one's a little bit different. Oh, hard to tell. Is that a fish? What is that shape? Maybe you can tell me in the comments. Another little rocket ship. Another little basket-like item. Ah, it looks like another little creature. His eyes and nose, little side wings, and then feet on the bottom. And then the last one is a repeat. All right, so we've seen a bunch. Now let's take a look at this before I go any further. Actually, let me do this. I'm gonna study this just a little so I don't rush through it. And then I will come back once I determine it looks like, well, let me see. I'll be right back. Let me take a look at this and then I will uh, continue on. All right, so that worked out because I needed to grab a pair of scissors. And yes, I do want to cut some candy apart, but I want to also get this done. So step one is pull the center tab down. Okay, I'm sure it just disposes of. Okay, and then step two, as these come apart. Now they are perforated, but scissors will aid in this process here. They're slightly rounded too on this part. Okay, let's get this one out of the way. It's nice that you can actually take your packaging and utilize it to make something out of it. Okay, so that's like that. There's your little 
character stands. They're out there saying that it's open and it's a toy store. Okay, so these are little candy toys. Now, I need to get this section out, which is probably why there's a thumb press there. Okay, let's just see if I can sneak in a pair of scissors here to kind of aid in this process. It looks like it goes all the way to the top, which means I probably don't need this here. This is kind of like the opening to the back of my store. Okay. I'm not taking any chances with the perforations. Let's just double check. Yep, all the way to the top. Now look at this. All this money is to be cut out. They show scissors there. That's going to take some time. I'll do one for you right now and then I will come back after I cut more just so you can see. Let me get these all out. I probably should do this first. Okay, and then I will just do this and then I will have to cut the rest. That's a lot of cutting to do on camera. Maybe I'll do a few, we'll see. And I'm gonna cut on the coin so that there's no border as opposed to the little line. I bet you a crafting tool probably will accommodate this kind of circular cut if you had one. Okay, there's my first coin. All right, now, these just fold out and then there's little notches here that look like they just slip over this. Okay, and then slip over this. And then this is your awning, your front awning to your little candy shop. And then this, they show in the picture, kind of in front. They don't show anything else being cut or altered there. And then that is what my stand looks like. Let's give you a nice front shot so you can see through the window. Kind of understand what's going on here. Okay, I'll turn it around so you can kind of see all the sides of it. Look at that. It's like spinning on its little carousel. Oh, come on up to the window and ask for a toy. Okay, let me cut some more of my money up so I can get it all cut. Then I will finally come back and I will taste one of these little candy toys. Looks like it's going to be fun. I will be right back. Okay, almost ready. Two more to cut. I thought I would break in here so you can kind of see what I'm doing. I'm not being too perfect here. I'm just trying to get my coins cut. I'm following around that outside edge and slowly cutting. Not perfectly round, but I think you get the idea. Okay, there's another one. Pretty neat that you can cut up all your little coins and use them to play. I guess you could have visitors come to your candy shop and pay you in this in these coins to get candy and toys. I guess they're, it's a toy shop. At first I thought it was an ice cream shop, but they're candy shaped toys. All right, so there's all my coins. Pretty neat, huh? I'll just let them sit there and then Zoom back up there. All right, so let's take, let's just see. Let me see if I can chip one of these little half moons out. I don't know what you'd call them, candy balls. Oh, they are full, look at that. So it's a full one. Let me bite just a piece. Mm-hmm. So it's got like a cookie center. Kind of like a Whoppers candy here but a little less dense than that. Yeah, it's good. So they are tasty. And I'll zoom right into my tray. Now you're looking into my toy shop. So you're gonna come to the window and then you're gonna pay me how much? I don't know, 100. Yes, may I have a toy for 100, please? What do I get for 100? Oh, thank you. You get a spaceship. Whoosh. Crunchy and tasty. I like it. Well, there you go. This is the next kit. I don't know if you've seen this one. 
If you haven't, let me know. If this is the first time you've seen it, let me know in the comments. And thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Ooh, the good part is I can replace it with that shape. What do you think that is? It's really hard to tell. And if you want to see more candy kits, look in that description. I'll have a playlist there. As always, you could just search Lucky Penny Shop. And thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.